Uh, I'm Kenny Barnwell, professional touring guitar tech. Uh, I've worked with acts such as uh, Travis Tritt, Clint Black, Trace Atkins, Joe Nichols, and I currently work for the band Perry um, with their big hit, If I Die Young. Um, anyways, I just wanted to uh, tell everybody why I use Peterson tuners and why I love Peterson tuners. Um, I use the Peterson 590 object strobe, and I've had it for about the past five years. Uh, and this thing has been all over the world. Uh, I also run through my new Stom Classic just to, to keep everything consistent and calibrated. Out here with the band Perry, uh, they're an uh, acoustically driven act, and so we use a lot of things like resonator mandolins, uh, we use ganjos, uh, multiple acoustics, and basically I have to trust my Peterson tuners because of all the overtones during the show, um, because my guitar world's always at the back of the stage or behind the PA, uh, I get an uh, immense amount of overtone. So when I tune with the Peterson, the Peterson is extremely accurate and shows me my true tunings um, versus any other tuner that I've used in the past. Need to be tuned in unison and what's great about my peterson tuners all of them from the headstock stock classic or my auto stroke is every, all three tuners will tune each string exactly the same when they're not in perfect unison it's very obvious that the notes are out of tune so that's one thing that i do lean on my peterson's for things like the ganjo for instance uh, is strung is basically a six string banjo and it's strung up as such and with tempered tunings on the b string uh, uh, the Peterson allows me to have my presets set up on my tuners to allow for tempered tuning without having to tune standard and then use my ear, which obviously on the side of the stage during a show you can't hear, um, to temper the B. So I have my preset tuners or my preset tunings embedded into my tuners and it allows me to keep the instruments in tune, especially the obscure instruments like these. Uh, we also use dobro as well, which when you have open tunings on the dobro, you get the same cause and effect with tempered strings. And when I use the Peterson dobro settings, it uh, just keeps it accurately in tune. Oftentimes, you know, especially with this bass right here, it's so percussive and it's acoustic in itself, but even ran through, uh, without the Peterson, and we've used other tuners, like when you drop down to a to a drop D setting, you oftentimes have to play the harmonic at the 12th fret, but every time we tune with any Peterson tuner that we have, it's never been an issue. You can, you can actually see how, it's, how it'll read up immediately, uh, all the way up and down without any, without any stutter, and then I'm perfectly in tune. So, I, we, we have the headstock tuner, we have the 590 that I religiously have used all around the world, and then my new Stomp Classic that I run through and let the other guys use. And then here's my backups, um, which obviously we don't use. So, why, why would you need to? Uh, we have things that are unopened, not even in the box. 